What's going on guys, Vitaly Dubin is here. Welcome back to another episode of Today's in Crypto Show. We are seeing Bitcoin is down today, altcoins are bleeding today. And the question is, how do we need to take a look at this? Is there a deeper correction happening right now? Or this is just a flash crash, a major trap for the bulls. And what I am thinking about those type of situations. So let's get right into it. Bitcoin has failed to hold $73,000 momentum and it was heating up on the RSI, getting higher and higher. The greed in the market was absolutely uh, huge. It actually went as high as 91. So right now it's cooled off just a little bit. The green is 83. It's still an extreme greed right now. So keep it on perspective. Yes, we are deep in right now, which is uh, uh, approximately, if you take a measured move, it is approximately from $73,000. It dipped about 10%. So it is okay for this market. We're still intact on the bullish trend. If you look at it, if you're in doubt, just zoom out. And you can see in the three months uh, chart, we are actually uh, breaking out in a major way. I mean, look at this beautiful, beautiful breakout on a three month chart. And as long as we are staying above $59,000, we are very, very bullish. So the bullish trend is still intact. If you look at a weekly, I mean, we are right now trading like we were trading like, uh, you know, seven days ago. Uh, who is saying that we are bearish? It may be like the, the, the sign of a deeper correction right now, but we are not in a bearish zone yet. It's just a 10% correction and the day has not even closed yet. I mean, look at what happened seven days ago, going from 68,000 all the way to $59,000 and then quickly reclaiming 66,000 and continue all the way to 73,000 thousand dollars so right now if we are going to consolidate for this uh, uh, zone of uh, between sixty six thousand dollars and seventy three thousand uh, dollars for the next uh, couple of days in this case it is going to be a very bullish environment for um, uh, for the altcoins actually to to uh, skyrocket right uh, Right now, what we are seeing, if you look at the, at the altcoins, we're seeing double digit losses. We're seeing 11 percent, 10 percent across the board. Uh, only Solana. Solana is doing today well, continuing to search 6 percent on the day. Uh, Fetch AI is uh, AI uh, coin is up 7% and Jupiter up 6 percent. So it just show you on these days how strong Solana is taking a market share of Ethereum. Ethereum is down, but Solana is up. So it's very strong, very strong performance uh, by Solana today. So definitely something that uh, is amazing to see. Why? Because <laughs> Solana is holding up very, very strong, which means that uh, it can uh, uh, go to the previous all time high sooner than we all think, right? It's $240, something like this. That was the previous uh, previous all time high for uh, Solana and Solana ecosystem is $256. Yeah, that was the high uh, point and Solana ecosystem coins are, are, are the ones uh, that basically uh, can also pump uh, uh, as well. So looking at the Bitcoin, uh, we bumped into a uh, bounce out of this uh, support area of sixty five thousand dollars approximately. So we need to see how the day is going to close. Uh, it's not closed yet, but if you fail to hold this area right here and we go below $65,000, then uh, the next one is going to be around like $60,000 approximately. The next area to take a look at. If you fail to hold $60,000, then uh, in the worst uh, scenario, we can uh, go to the zone of support of $52,000. Although I don't think it's likely that we are going to fall that far uh, because there are whales that are buying uh, like crazy. I mean, look at this every day, 100 Bitcoin, multiple times a day, 100 Bitcoin, 100 Bitcoin, 100 Bitcoin. There is somebody that is accumulated. Maybe it's a nation state. Maybe it is a uh, you know, a country, maybe it's a person, but it's a consistency, a hundred Bitcoin accumulation 
uh, multiple times per day yeah accumulating the dips and there's a dip so the dip you need to accumulate now um, the way to deal with it is is you always have to have some th something on the side some cash on the side so when coins are starting to go up when Bitcoin is going up like this and it went out in a parabolic move before the halving <coughs> what you want to do when the altcoins when are performing very well Bitcoin performing well, well very well you, you want to keep like 20-30% uh, cash out on the side just in case there is a uh, crashes are gonna happen which they are even in the bull market we need to reset their side we need to refuel it's gonna happen nothing unusual yeah um, so you have some power to to buy buy the dip now right now it's possible it's a very short crash and we're gonna continue moving up um, or it's possible to have a deeper correction of about 17% or up to 30%. If you're going to go to 30% correction, this will be the levels of epic. If you can buy during these times, it's going to be epic. If you have some cash on the side to buy at these levels, okay? Of course, altcoins are going to bleed if Bitcoin is going to come to $52,000. But right now, uh, what's important is to understand that the, the trend on a higher time frames on a weekly on a monthly it's actually intact because we're actually in a bullish very very bullish territory right now uh, still we are in extreme uh, levels of greed uh, and the moment 83 and uh, you need to be careful yeah, you need to be careful right here um, if, if you're trading in a short-term pattern then uh, you can be um, annihilated here <laughs> you can be wrecked here uh, or if you're more patient and you're gonna see uh, we are holding this level of support and will continue to climb up because the we are on a shorter time frame we are on the downside we're in the oversold territory if Bitcoin is gonna climb right here back to 70 71 thousand dollars and continue altcoins are gonna follow and uh, create a nice bullish uh, pattern I'm talking about Ethereum and the uh, Shiba Inu and Dogecoin and the uh, dot and uh, all of this near rune a lot of these coins <laughs> are gonna continue moving up if we fail to hold this level and if we go to another zone of sixty thousand dollars well the altcoins are gonna bleed more right but this is a strong very strong area of support gonna be at sixty sixty two thousand dollars and even at this point at 62,000 actually at 62,000 we're gonna go into a short term like bearish momentum zone on the weekly we're gonna um, possibly for for like a couple of weeks max a couple of weeks max and then going back back to the previous all time high why I believe so because uh, the halving is coming the halving of Bitcoin is halving just in uh, 30 something days from now you can see 34 days is the Bitcoin halvings and after that it's going to be even more bullish and we're going to go to $80,000 Bitcoin. So um, yeah, keep keep things into into perspective. Uh, we have uh, um, a dog with a hat. Solana, Jupiter are holding very, very strong during this dip. Um, why Bitcoin is down today? Well, uh, Binance deposit wallet uh, moved uh, basically uh, uh, 4,637 Bitcoin there is somebody that dumped 4,637 Bitcoin uh, on uh, on Binance yeah and uh, that's why the dip the dip is happening but it's okay <laughs> it's gonna be absorbed it's gonna be absorbed uh, by the by the whales okay you can see the U.S. national debt is increasing by 145,000 Bitcoin per day, per day. Think about it. In 145 days, there will be 21 million Bitcoins more in debt. That's on top of the 492 million coins of debt they already had. Crazy. But yeah, uh, 70K per Bitcoin is expensive. It's not expensive if you, if you look at the, at the bigger picture. Now looking at the, the senators of usa we have elizabeth warren that has been surging like crazy uh 300 all time today it's been up 124 percent 
trading on radium 6.7 million dollars in volume that's crazy uh, <laughs> this is like um, a token of uh, uh, US uh, uh, senator you can see right here derogatory Elizabeth Warren meme coin deleted from Coinbase website it was created like very very uh, automatically uh, it took down the web how, how to buy Elizabeth Warren <laughs> <laughs> derogatory token reference in US Senator Elizabeth Warren because she was like bearish on, on cryptocurrency uh, meme coins traders are flocking to uh, Elizabeth Warren yeah uh, he's a prominent crypto critic yeah basically uh, we included we included the instruction how to make it easier for you to buy uh, Elizabeth Warren <laughs> look at this screenshot <laughs> what you learn about Elizabeth Warren where in, where in how you can buy Elizabeth Warren <laughs> look at this price 3.6 cents oh my gosh um, now it's 29 I mean look look at this crazy look at this search from the 13th of March in two days the coins has increased increased by 10 times it's insane it's insane what's going on with this market so uh, stay safe stay safe uh, nothing to worry about nothing to panic it's uh, it's a simple dip of 10% in the in, in case of a bullish turn we're still very very right now uh, bullish 86 on the RSI actually on the weekly uh, on a daily, we start to reset this RSI, so it's all right. Uh, we may stay for a little bit here. If it's going to go down around, uh, towards the 50 area on their RSI, that will be epic to buy altcoins, to buy uh, Bitcoin, of course, and altcoins during this period. Okay, I hope it makes sense and uh, you have a fantastic end of the week. Uh, stay safe trading the markets and investing in the cryptocurrencies. And I'll see you in the next uh, episodes.